Dear friends, we are gathered here in the presence of God and these witnesses to unite this couple in holy marriage. The two of you are embarking upon an adventurous voyage across the restless sea of the rest of your life. You are standing now at the helm of a home about to be launched. Walk with the master, work on the marriage. One of these without the other is useless as your union, but both of them align in both your lives will provide accurate navigation, even in the wildest typhoons. Walk with the master, work on the marriage. All right, ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for this gorgeous, beautiful couple, Aman and Tokoa. This is Dipali and Vishal. We are welcoming you with a warm heart and lots of joy to this beautiful, glorious celebration. There's lots in store for you, lots of fun, lots of music, lots of love. One more time, give it up for Raman and Tukawa. And for yourself, everybody of you guys, you were awesome, thank you. here in the bay is calm but soon within days and months the wind will blow harder the waves will curl higher as you plow the deep now if this ship that we are launching today on this sea of matrimony is a fellowship of first John 1 7 Jesus Christ will be the captain and the relationship will be a godly partnership, not a godless battleship. That a strong and successful marriage requires two people choosing to love each other, even on those days when they struggle to like each other. 
And in the six years I have known you, Tokoa, I have seen you choose to love Amen 2,291 times. That is the number of days that Tokoa and I have been friends. sail on when the soft winds of pleasant days blow upon it. It will sail on when the billows of misunderstanding, sickness, tragedy, and death crashes against it. It will sail on because it will be steered by Jesus Christ, blown on its way by the winds of the Holy Spirit. can give you this golden compass is because based upon 1 John 1 7 it comes straight from the Lord himself who said in this verse if we walk in the light of his presence we will have fellowship with one another and the blood of Jesus Christ cleanses us from all sin. taking this woman I hold by the right hand to be my wedded wife and taking the man that I hold by the right hand to be my wedded husband <laughs> to be my wedded husband before God and these witnesses before God and these witnesses I promise to love him I promise to love him to honor him to honor him to cherish her cherish her in this relationship in this relationship and leaving all others and leaving all others cleaving only onto her Leading only on to her. All things a true and faithful husband. All things a true and faithful husband. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. Then you are each given to each other for richer and for poorer, for better, for worse, in sickness and in health, till death shall you part. The shape of the ring reminds us that marriage is a never-ending relationship, which grows ever sweeter through the ever-encircling years. The goal has given us a lesson about the glory and the purity of the home. With this ring I thee wed. With this ring I thee wed. With love and joy. With love and joy. Through the grace of the Father. The grace of the Father. And of the Son. And of the Son. And of the Holy Spirit. And of the Holy Spirit. Now upon the mutual promise made in the presence of God and these witnesses, and according to the authority invested in me as a minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ, I pronounce you husband and wife. Let me kiss the bride.
Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Blair. Welcoming the bride and the groom. Thank you. I want to thank everybody for coming today. I want you guys to have a wonderful, wonderful time. Enjoy. <laughs> Something special happened to me last night. I found a little gift from my new daughter-in-law. She left this last night on my pillow. She writes, today is the day I take the name of the son that you have raised. See, I told you I was going to cry. <laughs> Thank you for teaching him love. Thank you for being a mother who looked in God above. If he honors his mother, his son will honor his wife. So as we pledge our vows this day to love and cherish each other, I'm honored to be the daughter-in-law of such a precious mother. Today, we all celebrate love, your love, and what you have in each other a best friend, a companion, and a partner for life. I love you guys both so much. Cheers to the Claire's. Koei, you look great. The bridesmaids, awesome. All right, where do I start with almond? Actually, I don't have anything good to say. Corey, you have to take over this one. Okay. <laughs> He's a guy you want on your side, not only on the ice, but definitely off the ice. So we all ask, please just take care of him. Almond G, AKA Drake the Rapper. <laughs> Cheers, everybody. There will be times when it will seem easier to quit than to knit, but it's not. Just keep on knitting your hearts together, committing yourselves to Christ, submitting yourselves to each other, and emitting the fruit of the Spirit in the context of a godly family life.